it's time to head to the zoo. Great day to get out there and maybe see some of the moose. Yeah, Neil Anderson joins us live from Swamico. Hi, Neil. Hey, good morning. Yeah, it's a great day to visit the zoo. I mean, the weather is finally cooperating. <laughs> and, and look at our moose. Our moose is finally cooperating. She's laying down. What we ended up doing is we kind of shifted her between this gate and we used a, a pole stick. And it's just a pole with a, a syringe on the end. We're able to get close enough to go ahead and from a safe, you know, like say a, a safe platform like this, to go ahead and inject uh, the tranquilizing agent. And, if, and I, know, I don't know if you can hear, but she's really snoring right now oh. and that's a good sign because when you, you when you go in there if you kind of hear that you know she's pretty well down uh, we just went in uh, dr. Gilbert uh, went in checked her out and uh, did feel the TB test and there is a reaction to the TB test it's enough that what we've got to do now is uh, we got to call a state vet, and uh, Dr. Gilbert's uh, doing that. And then she comes in, and what she does is a um, comparative test. And what you do is not only the mammalian TB injection, but you use also an avian TB injection. Now, every moose that we've had out here, as far as I can remember, has always had a false positive like this. And then what we do is we've got to go through the same test and then a comparative. They use a little caliper, so they, you know, they'll go ahead and measure you know, the size of uh, the particular uh, swelling area where the TB injection is. And, and then once that is cleared, it looks like uh, we'll probably be uh, next week. Uh, we've got to do this within 72 hours, so it looks like uh, next week we'll be uh, moving her. So she's got another week back in the animal hospital area. But you can see why it's so important, though, to quarantine your animals, too, because you want to make sure when you come in that uh, obviously they're not uh, carrying any disease and uh, you want to do all the testing that you, that you need to do. i got to tell you, that doesn't look like the most comfortable position to uh, be in when you're <laughs> sleeping. Does a moose usually sleep like that? Well, I'll tell you what, usually you do, but usually they're more sternal. So she's kind of laying up now. She's using, you know, the, the wall to go hold her hold herself up like that in that particular position. But, you know, you always have to kind of go out there. So when we went out there and Dr. Gilbert was uh, working on her, we should place a towel over the eyes just so that uh, she, she can see us. And then we went over and we had, there was a needle from uh, the previous injection earlier this morning. That was removed, checked her all out. And uh, yeah, we know we've got to go ahead and, and uh, retest her. So, yeah. you know, that's kind of usually what we end up doing with moose. For some reason, they're real sensitive on that. <laughs> but now Sunday, uh, we have Mother's Day uh, at the zoo, and all moms get in the zoo free. And the first 500 get a Saruji's chocolate and a plant from Worries Farms. And we're really, you know, glad they've been a sponsor. Uh, both, uh, both of those organizations a sponsor uh, of the Mother's Day event, and it's a great time to come out and get connected. And you know, we got all, you know, most of the animals are out and about uh, in the exhibits, and especially with the nice sunshine, it's, it's a great time to come on out and visit the zoo. Yeah, and you usually have a pretty good crowd out there, then, Neil. Yes, we do. Uh, it's usually a great time, and we'll be checking. Actually, today I'm going to be checking one of the zookeepers. We'll be checking the yard, and uh, if the weather is the way it looks and it's dry enough that the giraffes will actually get outside. Oh, that'd be Maybe great get outside to see. Today. <clears throat> a that's sign of spring. That's always nice to see. Yeah. You know, and it's funny, and I can tell you, it's funny with them because as soon as you put them out, they'll just do laps and laps, and they're all excited. And then the lions check them out, so all the neighbors go, "Hey, the giraffes are still here." So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Excitement for Mother's so, Day. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It's fun to watch the animals check each other out then, too. You know? Yeah. So that, it'll be a lot, a lot of good time. All right. Thanks, thanks Neil. Neil. Hey, sounds good. Have a great day.